you already know it's an anything art. Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we're gonna get right into it. I'm basically gonna show you all how I put together my paint kit orders. So here's the first step. I actually have to build the box. So I get them flat from Paper Mart. I'll include all the details. They're about 17 inches by 11 and two and a half inches deep. So here I'm just basically tucking the side in and I have to, that part that you see there, I'm shoving it downwards and it has to kind of pop into place. Okay, I'm gonna do the same thing to this side right here. Also, I know y'all see my ashy hands. Don't mind it. I paint a lot, so I wash my hands often. They get dry, okay? Now I'm gonna start putting my uh canvases inside and all the other materials. So usually what I would do is put my canvases in this plastic right here and uh seal it with my paint palette the aprons and brushes all that good stuff but i have a new shipment coming in of more of these so i ran out so we're going to improvise so what i'm going to do instead is i'm going to use tissue paper and put my canvases wrap my canvases in the tissue paper so yeah instead i'll wrap my canvases in the tissue paper so i'm going to go ahead and do that Two paint palettes in there. And also aprons. I provide aprons on all my paint kits. Put some aprons in there. And I'm going to tape the back of this up. Okay, so now it's all taped up. I'm gonna go ahead and put some more tissue paper in the box. Then I'm gonna place the paint kit in there. Okay, so now that it's all taped up, I'm gonna go ahead and put some more tissue paper inside the actual box. Then I'm gonna go ahead and place my sketch canvases with the paint palettes, the brushes, the napkins. I'm gonna go ahead and flip it and place it inside. Okay. I want it to look nice and pretty, so I am gonna put some decorations in there. I have these. I'll just place it right here on the side. These are my Valentine's Day paint kits. So I do like to include a lot of decorations. So I also have some hearts so I'm going to put in there. You know, I want to keep it fun and festive. So when um, my customers open it, they're really excited to paint. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and put that in there. Then I'm gonna put my paint over here. Okay, so this is why I include my paint in. I don't, I try my best not to fill it all the way to the top. This is more than enough paint. My canvases are only 11 by 14, so this is enough. So I don't wanna go all the way to the rim because you don't want it to spill over. Okay, now that's all filled in, I'm gonna go ahead and close them. You have to make sure these, like, you have to hear at least a clicking sound. Okay, there it is. Let's do 
this thing will spill. All right. Let's keep pressing down until I hear it clicks. Okay, you guys, so now I'm going to go ahead and place the shanks in there right here to the side. I'm going to put the packing slip in there. I'm also going to include a uh, thank you notes. Okay. I also include step-by-step -step directions, so I'm going to place that in there as well. I'll place it right beneath the packing slip. Okay, so these are my step-by-step -step directions. I kind of just have them really organized, like all the titles of my paintings, and I can just flip to it. Okay. So yeah, now my paint is basically done. I'm gonna add a little bit more branding on there and I'll show you guys what that looks like. Okay, so I'm gonna include this on my box, it has like my social media, all that. Here, this little note with my social media. So now I'm just gonna go ahead, it's all done. I'm gonna go ahead and close it up. And I'm gonna add some additional branding on the outside. Close it up. And then I add my logo again to the outside, right in the middle. Okay, now it's ready to be placed in my poly mailer. So my poly mailer is purple because most of my logo is purple, you know, for royalty. That's why I included that as my main color. So I'm going to place the box in the poly mailer, put the postage on there, and also another branding logo on there. So my postage is on there and it's now ready to be shipped. Leave a comment if you have any questions about anything in this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I give tips on paint parties and tips to make you a better artist. If you like this content, please subscribe, like, and share. I'll see you guys in the next one.